Hello and welcome from Eastern Europe, my name is Cold Verage and this is a very quick look at the most interesting upcoming real-time strategy games of 2019. Conan Unconquered this is basically they are billions, but in the Conan universe, where instead of zombies you have to defend against endless waves of warrior creatures, like skeletons, giant bats and spiders. A lot of spiders, just like in Australia, well maybe a bit less. But anyway, I can bet that sooner or later a mod for arachnophobes that replaces spiders with some fluffy pink bunnies will be released. The project is developed by Petroglyph Studio, known for Star Wars Empire at War, Grey Goo and Forgotten Battalion. In addition, many of the developers working on this team have co-created the Command and Conquer and worked on the second Dune. So everything looks nice in the competence field, but the game itself, when I look at the gameplay, feels a bit slow and it might be a problem for fast-paced combat fans. The Settlers. This is basically The Settlers 8, but also a reboot of the franchise. The primary objective here is to provide wellness to the citizens of the settlements. This can be achieved by improving the military and economic state of the settlement, the necessity to motivate the settlers to work and provide them with food, and it's not announced but I hope also with vodka, is a novelty in the series. A story campaign that can be completed alone or in cooperation mode is the main pillar of The Settlers. The game also features optional side missions and multiple multiplayer PvP battles, but I don't think that settlers are famous for PvP battles, well, we'll see. Iron Harvest Inspired by the paintings of Polish artist Jakub Rozalski, the title presents an alternative history of Europe in the year 1920, roughly around the time my babulia was born. The technological development took a different turn than in reality. In addition to planes in the air and prototype tanks, the humans invented giant walking machines. So this is alternative past, but with robots. Sounds and actually looks really good. Wouldn't be surprised if there was a company named Skynet that did all of this. Warcraft 3 Reforged while Blizzard fails to bring joy to the fans because it got greedy, the remake of Warcraft 3 can still catch your attention. Not necessarily because if you played it before and you got bored by it, it will bring almost nothing new and I doubt there is any reason for you to buy it. But if you never played Warcraft 3, it's a great opportunity to play one of the best strategy games ever made. Campaign is simple 10 out of 10. It's flawless, it's like vodka filtered with coal, silver, diamonds and tears of unborn unicorn. It's that great. One of the best I ever played and multiplayer battles are also really fun. Except the fact that there are few thousand people in the world that can crush you in a 1 vs 1 battle with their eyes closed. Because you know, the game was released in 2000 and two and people had some time to practice, so it will be really hard for you to get to the top of the food chain. Ancient Cities here you start in the Neolithic era and work your way towards newer ages. In terms of the mechanics, Ancient Cities is similar to popular RTS games and simulators which require the player to manage a city. Consequently, the player needs to gather resources for construction of new buildings, take care of security related issues through building defensive structures, as well as to provide necessary means and tools for everyone so they can do their part for the group. To understand this game, let's imagine that Far Cry Primal, while being drunk raped Age of Empires at the party, and poor game had no money for the abortion, so the ancient cities was born, then left at the children's house where it learned new tricks from other games, sometimes copied them without any hesitation, but in general, when he grew up it looked like a strong and beautiful game. That's it, the list is over, but also keep an eye on Age of Empires 2 and 3 definitive editions. They should be released this year, sadly at the time of the creation of this video there were no footage I could show you. Also the guild free and the foundation could also interest you. Thank you for watching, if you liked my video please press that like button and if you want more lists like that don't hesitate and subscribe for more. Thank you for watching, have a nice day, bye.